Hi everyone, welcome to the 88th session of Python for Machine Learning. In this session, I'll show you how to install the graph with Pi.plus and execute it to generate the decision tree graph in Anaconda Spider. I will simply execute the Python code for decision tree classifier, but I'll not explain decision tree that I'll explain in it in the later sessions. So first of all, what we need to do, the steps are as follows. We need to install the graph with for Windows. Then we need to set the environment variables followed by finally installing the pi.plus in anaconda prompt. So what I will do, we'll go here and we'll give install graphvis. You go to here, okay? And then stable 2.38 window ins install package. And then from here, you just install this. Now, because I have already, I've already installed this, so I will pause it and I'll use my existing. We need to, like it will automatically take, you have to just press the but buttons next, it will be installed. So you can close this. Now, once this is done, we, you need to go, like you need to go to the program variable and uh, like program files, go to uh, Windows, then program data this, and then go to graphviz. And then go to bin. You take this full path, control C. Okay. Now this PC. Properties. Go to advanced system settings. Then environment variables. You click, uh, go to this path and click edit. And then add here. I have already added. You can just give new and then you can give your okay so i will this is how it will be done okay now after this is done what i will do this is my code for the decision tree this is my code for the decision tree classifier. I have already installed GraphViz and as per this steps, step one and step two is being achieved. Now we need, we have not installed the pi.plus, okay? If we execute this, what error we'll get? Okay, it will say that pi.plus is not found. So what we'll do, we'll, uh, we'll go to anaconda prompt. So what I will do, I'll, and I'll give pip, pip install. And then pi dot plus. So if we execute this, so that we have installed pi dot plus and this is being executed. And our graph is written to iris 2pdf and iris 2.png. If we open this, so if we open this, we can see the graph is like is has come here. Now if you want to go into the code. It is like it is a normal decision tree, but this dot data is where everything is being handled. Now, dot data is how the data from this is being entered into the graph. So that I'll be showing you the details, how the entropy works, how you uh, get the information about the, the details about the information, get the certainty and certainty about the uh, pure subset and the impure subset okay so this is how you get the visualization of decision trees using graphics and pi pi dot plus so that's it for the session uh, thanks a lot for watching this session if you feel this session is helpful please press the like button and subscribe to this channel and i'll see you in the next video thank you